Hello my friends, today we are talking about alternatives to the very popular but unfortunately discontinued Louis Vuitton MM favorite. So if you have the favorite but are, you know, like me and wanted to get a second one in a different print, or if you've always had your eye on it but you still want to get something new or something similar, then keep on watching. I was inspired to do this video when I was uh, speaking with a friend of mine who was looking to get her first Louis Vuitton bag and she wanted to get the MM Favorite, but unfortunately because it's discontinued, she can't. Now we will get into ways that you can still purchase it pre-loved, but she was really looking to buy her first bag and to go in to the boutique and have that experience. Now of course with COVID-19, she's not doing that anytime soon. But I was starting to recommend her some products and I thought this is something that you guys would find helpful. So let's get into it. So to start, this is my MM favorite. I have it in Demier Azure and it was my first Louis Vuitton bag. I love this for spring summer. It feels so beautiful and feminine. It's so, so pretty and soft and like a little slouchy. Um, I do have one complaint about it though and that is the, and I think a lot of people have this complaint, but the magnetic closure. Uh, I always have to be very careful what I put inside because I'm always worried that things are going to fall out. So uh, the two bags that I am going to be recommending are both from Louis Vuitton uh, and we are going to have a bonus uh, more affordable pick as well. But the two bags I'm going to first recommend are from Louis Vuitton and I think both of them solve that problem. So I purchased this bag in 2019 and it was $1,300. So the first bag I'm going to recommend is the Felice Pochette. And right now, I should say all prices are in Canadian, right now this bag actually retails for $1,290 Canadian dollars, which means it's actually a little bit cheaper. Now, there are a couple of things I love about this bag. Uh, and I should say that's the price for the canvas. If you did want to get in the emprunt leather, it's $1,650. And while that is a lot of money to spend on a bag, in the world of Louis Vuitton, it is pretty reasonable. So what I like about the Felice Pochette, which I'm gonna put up here, is first of all, it's a similar size. It's, you know, you can wear it crossbody. Um, it has the chain instead of uh, the leather, but I actually think the chain is an upgrade because with this leather, you have to be very, very careful. Um, you know, as it, as it goes to the patina, you have to be very careful that you're not getting water droplets on it. I don't like to wear it in the rain. Um, so it does have the chain and actually has a little button closure. It sort of looks like an envelope. The other bonus that I love about this bag is it has a little sort of wallet insert. And I'm not gonna lie, I do just want the wallet insert. Um, if I was going to purchase this bag, I mean, of course, I love Damier Azure, but as someone who already has the Damier Azure, I really like the Rose Poudre um, Emprunt leather. I think it is so, so pretty. And for a leather bag from Louis Vuitton, like it's, it's pretty good. Um, but if I was going to get it in the canvas, I would personally get Monogram because I already have the Demi Azure. If you don't have the Demi Azure, um, I, I love, I love Demi Azure for spring summer. The next two bags are sort of a two in one. Uh, they're two different bags, but I'm putting them under the same umbrella. So first we have the Corset Chain Wallet. I was gonna say Wallet on Chain. We have the Corset Chain Wallet and you can get it in the Demi Azure with the Rose Ballerine little little bits to go with it. So if you're going for the Wallet on Chain, you're getting a very similar piece in the sense that it's smaller, it's simple, it's not gonna fit a lot, but it's kind of great for every day, especially in spring, summer. It's just a very pretty casual bag. And for me, that's what the MM Favorite is. Now your other option, if you wanted to sort of bring it up a level, is the Crosette. The Crosette is 2,200 Canadian dollars. It has a top handle, which I think is super cute. And like the MM Favorite, it does have the leather strap. Uh, it has a little bit of gold hardware on it, and it actually has a little tassel on the side. So that bag is actually on my wish list. I think it is so, so pretty. It is a bit of a different vibe. It's not as slouchy as the MM Favorite, but if you're looking for that boutique experience, I think it's going to fulfill a similar place in your collection in that it's crossbody and it's casual and you can wear it every day. And again, it is super pretty. If you are looking to purchase the MM Favorite, then you are going to unfortunately, well not unfortunately, but for those who want the boutique experience, unfortunately, go the pre-loved route. So I've just pulled up Fashion File really quickly. I also love the Real Real, but I just, I just wanna give you guys a sense of the pricing. So you can get a Demier Abin Favorite MM for $16.45 US. I'm gonna leave some links down below on this bag. Um, obviously they're in different condition, 
we've got a Damn Near Azure Favorite MM for $13.65. So you can see that this bag is generally going, I think actually consistently going above retail um, because let's see what 1365, 1365 USD to Canadian. Yeah, so that would, the 1365 uh, bag puts it at 17, just shy of 1750 Canadian dollars. So you are paying a premium because it's been discontinued. Now again, this was a very, very popular bag. I think the words from my friend when she found out I had it were, oh my God, I hate you. I know she doesn't hate me, but Nora, if you're watching, hey girl, this video is for you. But I told her that I think the best, um, the best Louis Vuitton bag that you can get in terms of similarity and price point is the fleece pochette. And I did promise you one affordable alternative, and that is by Kate Spade, and it is the Laurel Way. It is currently for sale in the Kate Spade Surprise Sale. But what it really gets right for me, and I do actually have one of these, it's just tucked so far away. Um, what I do actually like about the Kate Spade bag is very similar to the Louis Vuitton, it does have the gold chain uh, to go along with the crossbody. So it has that very similar detail, again, a similar size. They have it in a really pretty chalk pink and a Nimbus gray, and I think either one of those could sort of scratch that itch if you were looking for Demi Azure piece, but maybe it's not in the budget right now. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. I hope you found it uh, especially helpful if you've had your eye and your heart set on an MM favorite and are looking for an alternative that you can buy new. And if not, I hope that it's giving you some information on where you can get one pre-loved. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Mwah.